No musical instruments were used in this video. Everything you hear are vocal sounds. Off in the car. That's what I wanted to do today. Adios. I am off of work and we're going to Costco, baby. We are putting <gasps> gas and baby hops that is being crazy. <laughs> I am in the trunk of my car right now and I'm waiting for Mohammed. I bought them a churro from Costco. So I just kind of picked all the groceries that we got. I did get some gancito, so I'm gonna eat a gancito in the car while I wait for Mohammed. This is everything that we got. Um, we're making salmon tonight. That right there with asparagus and stuff. So I'm in the Starbucks drive through. I'm going to be ordering a grande ice white chocolate. No, I'm not. A grande brown sugar oat milkshake and espresso with two sundaes. So I don't see a car in front of this car. I think they are still ordering. We are next in line. Thank you. Thank you. Thank Thank you. I was always a Look at the sky, looks beautiful, y'all. Oh my god! <laughs> I, I got my outfit for diner. We have Salomon with sticky rice, seaweed. <laughs> we just went to the store, alhamdulillah. I got some MMs. I was craving some, and my husband was like, Go, run, sneak out, don't let her see you baby have some and i went out to get me some peanut m&ms that i really love so much but i'm gonna try to wake up at five in the morning to work out and we'll see if it happens because i haven't worked out for two weeks all right i'm going inside now for dinner we had salmon it's boring old dinner alhamdulillah though but you know same old same old it's saturday morning i've already woken up for pleasure Baby Hops is still asleep, so what I'm going to do right now is get on the elliptical for an hour. Hopefully, I am crossing my fingers because when she wakes up, I'm sorry to say, but it's hell in the house. And she doesn't let me do anything. So I'm going to work out. I'll see you guys later. I got my drink, my headphones. Hopefully, I can get at least 30 minutes. I promise you, I haven't worked out for like, what is it? two weeks this would be my third if i don't start again so i've just been having a really rough time with the baby okay 155 minutes 649 calories i actually did an hour but i had to get up to do something while i was on it for five minutes so i did do a whole hour alhamdulillah and i am sweating and it's time for me to shower oh my guys He's like, what are you drinking, woman? It feels so good, oh my God, to work out. It's crazy because once you do it, it's like, why did I even stop? And honestly, I know it sounds like, you know, bull crap and like just excuses, but I promise you, you know, my two-year-old goes through a lot of like emotions and I noticed that she's like a really angry baby. Although I will admit this is like this was like one of oh my god one of my easiest pregnancies alhamdulillah. You want some water? He's like, what is it? Let me give him He's smelling it. This water, you want some water? But alhamdulillah, she was like one of my easiest pregnancies that I had. And, you know, they got easier and easier because we were like more stable. We were financially stable. We, you know, we had a home. That like, cat keeps trying to slap me and it's kind of scratching me. Crazy little one. 
so yeah baby Hafsa was one of like my easiest pregnancies because we had a roof over our head we were financially stable and alhamdulillah i you know had a job i was commuting back and forth to work so i didn't have much stress but she came out with so many emotions like she gets really upset and she like literally hits herself throws herself and my two boys never did anything like that she also like screams off the top of her lungs if she doesn't get in her way and she's like really complicated right now she keeps trying to like take her shirt off and take her pants off she wants to just be in the house in a diaper and we literally have an ac and everything like it's not too hot or anything and she just i don't know if anything she's like not spoiled but in a way gets what she wants you know what i'm saying so yeah i'm just drinking some ice water you know i got this cup for sale it was like nine dollars they were trying to get rid of a bunch of cups and yeah i got it for nine bucks otherwise i wouldn't have bought this these are normally like 20 something dollars so this was i should have got two because it would have been like you know two for the price of one and gifted it to my mom or my sister I'm gonna drink this water and then go upstairs and take a shower. Look at my guy, he's ready to slap me. He's just standing there waiting to tap me on my face. Look at him, look at his hand. Look at his hand. I actually just had two eggs, sunny side up, with some ketchup, salt and pepper. And a sourdough bread with honey and crunchy peanut butter. And I'm having some coffee now. I'm not gonna drink the whole thing. I'm just drinking it because I have a slight headache. At 11.15, I do have a laser hair removal appointment. So I'm gonna go to that. We're grilling some burgers on the grill. We're gonna do like lettuce burgers. This time I, I want to try to make some veggies on the side instead of french fries, so we'll see about that, yeah. Can I wash some clothes? Yeah. Of course. Sisters, so this is my old mirror that I use when I'm like putting on makeup and stuff. It's broken. So we're going to toss this one in the trash. I've had this one for a couple of years, like four or five years it's crazy it feels sad to try to like let it go it's weird i don't understand 11 15 and then i got this one that lights up when you open it it's cute this is like, i came to my table. appointment oh, for laser away yeah, like so cute. Laser away. We got a halal pepperoni. This is a combination pizza, y'all. Halal right here. You want to try this? Sisters, I was trying to take a nap, but baby Hopsa just kept crying and crying and screaming and screaming. And my husband was like, just go get some coffee and she'll fall asleep in the car. So that's what we're going to try and do she's in the back eating a gancito i'm literally about to cut her hair i'm gonna cut it to her shoulders because she doesn't like to brush it and it gets super tangled back here so i i do think i should cut her hair and the hairstyles that i can do is like two little ponytails you know so inshallah i am going to be cutting her hair sisters what's Muhammad. up Mohammed went to go yeah. give me my Starbucks and baby Hafsa is asleep so we are about to go home oh, no. and take a nap. Did you guys see that mess behind me? Let me show you. I'm drinking my coffee and about to clean the car and the garage. The garage is dirty. Every time we go somewhere and we buy stuff out, I just literally, hey, we went out, you know, went to Oakland, bought a couple things, and the kids leave things in the car. Prime example, bottles, empty Diet Coke cans, wrappers, hopperware that probably had fruit, wipes, and receipts. 
and an empty diaper bag. Yeah, I'm about to clean all that mess. Oh yeah, so when we go out, you know, we just rush out of the car and are trying to go in tired or eat whatever we bought or whatever it is that we're doing. And then we forget about the things in the car. And then when I have to go run an errand or my husband is gonna go to the masjid or whatever it is, what it is, then I open the car and see all this junk and I have no room for my feet. So what I do is throw everything out and I toss it right on that side. And that's disgusting. So I'm gonna clean that up. It's Labor Day. It'll be Labor Day weekend, so we're off on Monday, Alhamdulillah. Um, and I don't have to work from home, so. Alhamdulillah. I need to start preparing to get my GED because they don't want to accept my high school diploma that I got. So now I got to redo that all over again because I'm trying to do, you know, school in Utah. But by January, I should be able to take either like a G GED or high school equivalent because the one that I have, the Utahs, the school in Utah won't accept. So that's going to be a whole nother trip. Anyways, okay, I'll see you guys in a bit. So I picked up most of the trash that was like right there and now I'm cleaning the car. The car is so dirty. So I'm like literally vacuuming every little detail. But look what came in the mail. This Bax came in the mail. The Bax, the Bax wasn't heavy. Look what we got. Walk it uh, uh, Comes with three of them. So one for me, one for my husband and one for the boys. Okay, so now I'm removing this plastic. We actually bought like a pack of this um, to put it in the car so it doesn't get like extra damage. As you can see, that one got messed up. So I'll have to take out my carpet cleaner, but I'm gonna remove this so that I can vacuum some of these parts and then probably carpet clean some of these because the inside just got in so filthy look. Okay, so <laughs> we connected the walkie-talkies. These are going to be actually really great in the morning because sometimes I'll wake up earlier than them and then I want to wake them up for a pleasure and then they don't wake up. But then when my husband wakes them up, boy, they wake up so quick. Muhammad, can you hear me? Muhammad, can you hear me? Yes, mother. Try to go farther, see how far it goes. Okay. These are pretty fun. Yeah. I think these really go pretty far out, by the way. I don't know if you know that. My friend Ethan has these and he can call his dad from the park to his house. What? So maybe he lives by the house. I don't know. Really close to the park. So, like, does his dad call him and be like, hey, come home? I didn't hear nothing you said. He just calls him. Keep going down, see if it works. What'd you say? I said go all the way down and see if it works. Okay. Can you hear me? Yeah, I can hear you. Be careful, there's a predator over there. Okay. <laughs> Yo, these are so fun. But why would you need these? Oh, like to hit the other person with the nerf gun? And, like tell your teammate to like, hurry up, come on. He's on the way, like in Call of Duty. You are so funny. What'd you say? I said you are so funny. The voice cut off. I said you are so funny. Okay, run back. Muhammad is getting his basketball from under the car. Muhammad's first game is going to be on Tuesday, so we're excited. 
Look what I'm printing, you guys. Don't mind the. You should have said anything. It would have been funny. Dusty printer, but we need. Gotta wait for that very. Okay, sisters. I slightly cleaned. Not too much. Just a little bit. I mean, tomorrow I'll finish it. So it is a fudger. So I just finished praying fudger down in my husband's office while the water is running to make him some tea. So I don't normally record in the mornings. I'm like so tired. But alhamdulillah, my husband woke up the kids and they wake up like this when he wakes them up. So I'm going to go to the kitchen now. I'm so sleepy, but I'm going back to sleep after this. So two sourdough breads of this kind. Irish breakfast tea. This is two tea bags. Go to the store. I totally forgot that we do not have milk. So we're gonna run me and Muhammad really quick. Muhammad Kisu Baba said to make me wanna wear these glasses. Because he said he liked the other ones. I was like, I like these more. And we started laughing so hard. That's funny. Crack, Mother? I got the milk, so we're gonna run really quick to the stuff. We're gonna go get the milk. Okay, Mohammed went in really quick. I can already see him right there with the red hoodie. He's gonna grab cereal and milk. And I'm in the car. Cause I don't have socks again. Taking the bread and the tea upstairs. Sisters, it's literally about to be nine o'clock. We just woke up, you know, from after um, going back to sleep after Fajr. One thing about waking up for Fajr, obviously, is that you can always go back to sleep, especially on the weekends. So I'm gonna get me a coffee cause I need to finish the car i'm gonna vacuum the inside again and uh carpet clean two sides of the car from the inside and then i need to put the tape on it so that's what i'm starting my morning with um but i need a coffee because i'm like real i could have literally kept sleeping but i got things to do so i yeah, and baby Hops is literally still asleep too. My husband got up and is gonna play a couple of video games or something on the PS4. But my husband doesn't play video games like that, but he does like to um, play like Tekken. We used to play that. I don't know if you're if you're if you're still here from like a year or two ago. I used to show that. You know, we used to, and when we lived in Oakland, we used to. Um, play Tekken and um, we used to pick our player and then like compete with each other so yeah but yeah I'm gonna go get Starbucks right now it is a full house today there's never really this much of a big line so what is <laughs> got my coffee Hold on. Canceling plans because I can't find the piece for the vacuum. So I'm just gonna try to scrub the little mold that's here. See that? It looks like mold. I think the liquid fell in there. So two dollars, yeah. My mom is gonna come to Muhammad's basketball game on Tuesday, so it's gonna be fun. But yeah, we're gonna have to. I have to clean it a different way, so I'm gonna close the garage now because she keeps running in the street. Even though there's no cars, she's just still running in the street, and it's really annoying. There we go. We're gonna cut Baby Hafsa's hair. <laughs> yes, my. So we're gonna cut Baby Hafsa's hair today. I need to go get some proper scissors because see back here, there's like a big old knot. And if I don't brush her hair every, no, if I don't brush her hair twice a day, you get this knot here. And if you have daughters, you know how hard it is to brush their hair. 
So my husband mentioned, let's cut our hair. And I was like, no. But then I thought about it. And I said, that's actually a really good idea. Because, number one, she's always home and doesn't like to brush her hair. And if I cut it to her shoulders, then I can always do cute little two ponytails or like half a ponytail or put a little barrette or something in her hair. So we are cutting her hair today. Her hair is like soft curls, but gets really tangled. So yeah. And the curls only, the curls are only visible when you deep condition the hair and then let it dry, like comb it with a larger comb and yeah so we're cutting her hair today okay i just wrapped all gotta wrap the two front seats and then we'll put the stuff on and it's all good to go it looks brand new anyway so that's why we keep this i didn't find a clear one we only had um only found one with these words and stuff so keeps the car clean especially when you got so many kids we're about to go pick up some halal Indian food and I'm gonna eat this gantito on my way there because I haven't ate anything. It's 11.44 and I've been cleaning the car all morning. And that's just like the inside, not even the outside. So we're gonna go pick up halal Indian food and then we are gonna come back home. Take what up, mama? Cut baby Hafsa's hair. Hey sisters, me and baby Hafsa are outside. The boys are gonna go outside and they're gonna play. Muhammad, can you hear me? Yeah. Did you open the door for your brother? <laughs> Don't call him that. Purple flower. Tell him Nina didn't have to knock more than once. You guys gonna have to wash my car. A smell? Mm-hmm. A smell yeah. Mm -hmm. It's a nose. I've been cleaning, mopping the flow. Um, we don't have nothing planned, but my husband didn't order some wings, and now I'm making these little biscuit pizza bites. We'll see how they come out. I've never made this before, so I'm gonna put these in the refrigerator. In the refrigerator. I'm gonna put this in the oven right now. Biscuit pizza. What is wrong with me? Biscuit pizza. Look what just happened. I dropped them. Ugh. Okay, now it's going because I literally dropped that one on the floor. What the heck? Magic Open that. Trick. Okay, we're going to put these up. I'm going <laughs> to melt some butter to put them on the edges. We'll see. This is what the little pizza, biscuit pizzas look like. This is what the bottom looks like. Um, they're pretty good. Next time I'm going to add a little bit more of tomato sauce and a little bit more cheese. Um, it's my first time making them, so they're actually really good. It's Monday, alhamdulillah. Um, there's no work today because it's Labor Day, so yeah, we're off today. And I'm just kind of cleaning the house. My mom is coming tomorrow with my little siesta. And Muhammad has a basketball game, so that's why they're coming to go to his game. But I'm just kind of cleaning up, tidying up, clearing out counters, basically, and putting things where they go. And then at the end of the night, I will be mopping the floor so it can be clean for tomorrow. So I'm just putting things away, like, you know, random things on counters that don't belong and hiding everything. Um, after I'm done, I'm going to go upstairs and shower. We woke up for Fajr, Alhamdulillah, all that stuff. Went back to sleep as per usual. Wash the car. We just washed the car. And we also washed my car my cow over there and we wash the mats 
And that's me, Hamid, over there. But we washed the cast today. You know what I'm saying? We washed the cast today. Starbox. Get my coffee, yo. The kids are at the park, and we're gonna go to Old Navy right over there and return some jeans that we bought. Guys, we cut baby Hussey's hair. Rainbow. She's so cute. Mashallah. Rainbow. Her little big flow head. Mashallah. Mashallah. I'm mad that there wasn't another steak. So after lunch, I washed all of those dishes that you see behind me and I need to dry them and take those dirty kitchen rags upstairs. Um, but I got a couple of shirts from Old Navy and I'm gonna show you what they look like. Not a couple, I got three. The first shirt I got, Star Wars. It's been such a restful day. Everyone's been taking naps all day. Um, it's time for dinner and we're gonna get some halal Chinese food, inshallah. Um, but yeah, we're gonna go pick it up, me and Mohammed and Hafsa. If you made it this far, don't be scared to join the sisterhood. Go ahead and subscribe to my channel, like this video, and go ahead and share my videos with other sisters who you might think will enjoy this kind of content. Peace and blessings and hope to see you in the next video. My videos are super random. I know I can't help it.